my default is to shrink when I feel uncomfortable. I'm like, mm, I'm about to get back in my little box. <laughs> Creators, welcome back to the studio. I'm Aramis the artist. Y'all, I'm so excited. Like, it's April, y'all. Pain Pro is here. I actually just finished uh, recording a video, The Creative Rituals. This video will go out after that, so you all probably seen it. If you haven't seen it, I'm gonna make sure I link it up below. Now that I'm all done, we are about to head over to my friend Twyla Studio. I'm so excited, I'm running late. I'm gonna tell y'all more about it in the car. Let's go. Perfect timing. It's gonna take me 18 minutes. That's exactly what I need. Y'all ready? <laughs> Let's go. So Twyla is a phenomenal jewelry designer out here in Seattle. Uh, I talked about her like a long vlog ago, like a minute ago, because I was wearing some of her earrings, uh, these beautiful eye earrings and- Is it red meat? So okay. we need a lot of beef in our family. <laughs> Uh, listening to Tom Bill you health theory love his podcast but anywho so she has a phenomenal business out here in Seattle where she designs jewelry like handmade y'all one-of-a-kind stuff and she also has stuff that isn't like you know limited edition so a variety of price ranges absolutely beautiful and she had this new collection that I saw on Instagram and I say sus um, we might need to talk <laughs> so we talked and we actually gonna be doing cross promotion for her business and for mine as well y'all know that I'm working on the scarves which I'm geeked about some photo shoots are happening soon so I'm gonna be rocking all of her jewelry uh, in these upcoming photo shoots so she'll be getting some scarves and um, I'll be getting some jewelry and we pretty much just cross cross pollinating with one another um i'm also gonna be shopping and buying some jewelry too so she's all over the social medias as well so i'm gonna make sure that i that i tag her she talked about starting a youtube channel too okay she got her camera she's ready to go and y'all know i'm the number one hype woman i be ready okay like i feel like i, I need everybody's social media manager out here okay because all my friends are dope and i'll be trying to put people on game to me y'all like i don't i don't even feel no type of way about being like salesy or weird because first of all my friends and include me too right has like dope stuff and i feel like it's just so ridiculous for people to to feel weird not ridiculous i get it i understand how our society can be but the people out here with some of the shittiest stuff be the loudest and the people who actually are making beautiful hand quality unique incredible pieces of art be like the most quiet about it and when you are that quiet your business cannot be sustainable because you can be amazing but it's no good if you the best kept secret out here in the streets because the streets need to know so that they can support your business. I be out here trying to help folks and I be out here trying to be be people we are. And of course, only stuff that I'm excited about and only things that I'm that I'm truly inspired by. And so Twyla is definitely one of those people. I was a part of her photo shoot that she did for one of her launches last spring uh, with the incredible, incredible goddess queen photographer, Jeanette. So y'all should check her out as well. Um, I had so much fun on that shoot with her. So Twyla is probably also gonna be modeling for me for the photo shoot too. So pretty much she's dope, she's amazing, she's a dear friend. If you looking for rings and tinks, <laughs> your girl got you. Wash my teeth up, wash my face. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Start my day. Wake up, get up, stretch my legs. It's the real. It's I mean, this is what's launching tomorrow. This Ooh. one of a kind collection. We can a sneak peek. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's launching tomorrow. And then this is actually June's one of a kind collection because I design early. So I'm working on June right now. See, okay. you for real. See, you, you designing early, you doing what you need to do. Like, this is how I design. I pull out stones. This is like what I'm working on for June. Okay. So I just like combining colors and then drawing. 
Well, I, I told them, right, y'all, look, this is Twyla, say hey. <laughs> now, I told them that you're gonna be starting a YouTube channel. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I want it. I want right, look, it. pressure. No, 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 when no is pressure. this releasing? I have to start one before then. For real? Like, yeah. you, you, like that's intense yeah. now. <laughs> But I this mean, should be going up. On it. Right, right, right. Well, no, look, have it up. Yeah. You don't have to have a video yeah. up yet. Look, tell them subscribe. <laughs> it's like Twilight Hill, right? That's Twi it. That's it. Twilight there Hill. you go. There, y'all. It'll be there. <laughs> like this, and then you wrap the stones around yeah, it. Yeah, so we're fabricating these right now. Oh, so, wow. Like, each stone is going to go in one of these like that and you do one at a time yeah. putting the stone in there one and then at a this time this is handmade chain so this wow. is going to be like you know that's beautiful that's beautiful wake up i can smell the smoke from the bacon let's go see the sun shining from the windows okay i know that today will be a good day i pulled out these okay. for you and I pulled out all these hoops. I know. <laughs> you know I love this. You know I love Drink some water. Brush my teeth. Get out of bed and I stretch. Totally. Ooh, they gonna love these. And they're not gonna kill them in the club. They're not gonna get stuck in your hair. <laughs> right? Right? So, they're smaller. Yeah. And I still keep it real as it is. I show my age, I don't switch. Often I'm just as a dad as a kid. 100%. And now, can they get these on your site? There's only one pair of those. Ooh, one left. Look, one, one left. So then here are the rings. These are perfect. Yeah. Because you said you don't know what size you are. Yeah. And see that hook? That's my, my hook. That's tiny as yeah. hell. Yeah. Like the camera can barely even see yeah. it. So that's how I crochet. Wake up. All the lace, all these pieces are like crocheted but waiting to be glued. Actually, and now what is and now like oh okay, it's, it's resin, resin on it. Mm -hmm. I see, so that helps keeps it clean mm -hmm. now. So now it's not mm -hmm. some wet, soggy thread. Yeah. So for the rings, they're all dipped in resin. It makes them kind of shiny and gemmy, which is super cool. I think that's fun. You know, mm -hmm. like I love the rings. I definitely want to do an eye. Yeah, I think the lips could be fun too. Yeah. And so what were this? Oh, uh, get out of bed and I stretch. Bed in my hair is a mess. A mess. Look through my clothes for a fit. Anything I do is drip. Oh, my Aren't these beautiful? Love them. We are back in the Studio 2 team. I can't remember. I think the last time I talked to y'all, I was just uh, seeing Twyla at her studio. And I am clearly obsessed with my rings. But I got some exciting news because your girl got the scarves. I don't even know if y'all ready. <laughs> Okay, don't get too excited. The launch is gonna be closer towards the end of April. I wanna roll it out in a special way, but I feel like I can share stuff with the tube team because like all of my Instagram people ain't, ain't over here. So I feel like we got a nice little intimate community going on over here. But these are the silk scarves. Okay, wait, let me go in order. See, I'm getting, I'm getting ahead of myself. This is the square. So in a previous vlog, I had showed you, I showed y'all how I was making like the leaf patches. Pretty much, um, since this scarf, the rectangle one, is really long, I had to put the image together twice. But then I had that hard seam, right? And so I went through on Adobe Fresco and erased everything else around and made these little leaf patches so that it can overlay on the piece, and so that would get rid of that seam line. And I felt, oh. I feel like it turned out really good. It turned out really good. You cannot see any harsh lines. It feels seamless. It feels like it's flowing. Yeah, absolutely love it. This is the silk. These are 100% silk. Then you have the long rectangle one. Now this is similar to the rebirth print that I created on the scarf. I am just wanna wear this. I'm about to wear this now. She bad, y'all, she bad. Okay, clearly the silk is my absolute favorite. And I also got satin. Let me show you the satin. Now, I think the satin is perfect for your hair. Like, I don't think I will wear it out as like a fashionable scarf. I think I would actually wear it to like wrap my hair. So the satin is really nice. The image doesn't transfer as well as the silk. That's why I think this would be perfect if you wanna wrap up your hair at night, keep them edges light, boo. So that was a long one and we have the rectangle. 
in the satin one as well. This year, we stepping it up. We leveling up all the things. Really trying to do it right. So I really want to do a nice rollout. Um, so these were some of the samples and I want to take product shots. So that's what I'm going to be working on today. But what was super exciting, Isaac was here this past weekend and we took some incredible photography. Hey Graham fam, I'm checking in with y'all. I see everybody tagging me in all of your beautiful creations. Keep on going. Okay, it's day three of April. I'm out here with Isaac. Okay, look, we got <laughs> He got cherry blossoms in my hair, okay? I'm excited for y'all to see these. So that's why a lot of my paintings are up and out of, out and about. I wanna keep them secret, but it's definitely different when you see them in person. So I don't feel too concerned about showing y'all. And you know Pisces is still a work in progress. This is Capricorn, so I have some laid out, one for the photo shoot, but also I need to touch them up a little bit, clean up some of the details so that they can be ready for their display. That Scorpio over there, Scorpio is a vibe, y'all. She is swimming in champagne. Cause y'all know I'm a Drake fan, okay? <laughs> and Drake is champagne poppy. But over here we got Libra, the air sign. She's holding the scales. Her dress is my absolute favorite. Yes. Yeah, so y'all will see those photos soon. I'll probably share them here, but I'll definitely have those up on my Instagram. We doing a whole rebrand and we leveling up the website. We getting new photos for all the things. And I just had a special, special person just leave the studio. I'm gonna tell, I'll be able to tell y'all more about that later. But um, I just did a reel on Instagram letting people know time to retire it's time to retire the babies it is time to retire the babies I feel all the feels about this this that'll be a whole nother conversation but let's take some photos of the scarves oh y'all all the feels oh I couldn't even take the photos of the scarves like let me turn the signal off so y'all can hear me. Your girl is going through it. You ever just feel like, uh, yeah. This gonna be for the patrons. I feel like, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know about YouTube yet. I don't know. I be hearing all sorts of stuff when people be trying to open up on the tube. Your girl might not be strong enough yet for all for comments. Some of them comment section it's been all love so far and i appreciate y'all but oh no one day one day it might turn on your girl and that's all right that's what that's what that's what comes with growth and i think like that's the part like that's the part that i'm resisting uh i just like keep trying to tell this mantra in my mind like don't shrink don't shrink don't shrink and it's just like because that is my default my default is to shrink when I feel uncomfortable. I'm like, mm, I'm about to get back in my little box. You know, like, I'm about, nah. <laughs> I feel like I'm out on the edge. <laughs> it's a little too much. <laughs> Ooh, why is that my truth? That is the truth. Y'all, I'm so excited. So what I recently did, I'm getting hot. Your girl's getting teary. <sighs> I recently did a year in review. So just did like some high level planning, right? So it's just like, what projects am I looking at in this entire year? And, ma and maybe that's the thing that's stressing me out. Like maybe I maybe I don't need to look that big. It's like, okay, Hermes, you don't, you, don't, you don't have to go that deep. But the thing is now that I have Shannon on board and just like building the team and I wanna build even more and like actually get a official social media manager, a studio assistant, a studio manager. Like just as I'm getting more people on the team, first of all, that's a process, right? Trying to properly delegate and properly communicate and like knowing that if I have a team now I have to be a leader, <laughs> you know? I have to show up, I have to, ooh, your girl looking rough. I have to lead the team outside of, of course, but sure, maybe that's too much pressure, but first of all, that's the truth. And second of all, now that you have people on board, you need to be clear on where you're going. You know, like what it, what is the plan? What are the tasks that you need to let them know so that you can get things off your plate and that you can create and do what you need to do. And 
in the midst of that, I'm like, let me break it down. Let's get a yearly plan. There's a lot going on this year, y'all. Like, my Hey, hey, she back and she better, okay? Y'all, your girl is feeling loads better. I had to get some things off my chest. I had to have some conversations. Yeah, pretty much we got some, I have a product launching soon, y'all, and I'm gonna be able to tell y'all about it as it gets closer to the date. The thing is, I'm launching it in August. And during that month, majority of the month, I'm gonna be out of town, okay? So this is an experiment. This has been a process of me building the team, growing, scaling, where I don't have to touch every single aspect of the business, where I can still go to Chicago and help celebrate my best friend's wedding and go to Sacramento and be with my family and just so many different things that are gonna be going on during the month of August where, but I still don't wanna have to halt the show and in the past everything would just stop if I'm gone and I'm really trying to learn how to let go delegate, really build a team so that I can make it work. But it is scary, y'all. It is such a vulnerable process. And yeah, this is just picking up from where I left off with the patrons. But you know what was really comforting? Um, Earth Mama Medicine, y'all should follow her if you don't on the gram and YouTube. She's an amazing woman who is, uh, she sells like Yoni steam kits and teas, all sorts of stuff. But she spoke about this on her Instagram post and she had a fulfillment center and just really had a horrible experience and had to bring it back in house where her and her partner were, were fulfilling the orders. And that's the scary part. Like when you handing over your baby, you're handing over your business to somebody else and having them fulfill your orders, it can really just be a journey, you know? So I'm just super grateful that I live in Washington and I found an incredible family owned uh, distribution and fulfillment center who will be shipping this limited edition, super fragile product that I'm gonna be making available soon. And I'm just, yeah, I'm just super duper excited. We just trying to figure it out. Um, this month it's April. I'm, you know what? Forget it. Forget it. I'm gonna tell y'all. I'm gonna tell y'all, okay? Am I gonna tell <laughs> I'm gonna tell y'all because we celebrating 2K and I'm just grateful that all of y'all are here, y'all. We hit a super big, <laughs> super big milestone, which might seem small, but look, if 2,000 people rolled up in my house, yeah, y'all seen that TikTok? It's real, okay? So I'm grateful for every single one of y'all. So just letting you know, coming in August, and actually it's gonna be August for the patrons only, and then. We're gonna roll more things out later. But in August, I am gonna be printing the Zodiac series on labels so that they can be a part of a candle collection. I'm doing all 12 of the Zodiac signs um, in these long, tall, like St. Mary's altar candles. <sighs> Did I tell them? I told them, I told them, y'all. <sighs> I'm super excited for these candles. I think it's gonna be amazing, y'all. They're gonna be limited edition. Get ready, okay, get ready. They're gonna be, look, speaking of, speaking of amazing, if you know, then you know. 20 years, y'all. You know, it's been 20 years since Badu released Mama's Gun. Crazy, anywho, but had to get her limited edition collection. And I feel like these are the moments that I cherish as a lover of art, as a consumer, as a like lover of music as well. There's so many things that I collect from some of my favorite artists and musicians. So I feel like for all my cosmic beings out there, for all of my, you know, astrologists, witches and wizards and light workers, I feel like this is just gonna be perfect. So, oh, I'm nervous. Like, why am I nervous telling y'all this? I don't know, I don't know. I just, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, I'm such a child. Anywho, if you made it this far in the video, use a real one, okay? Uh, this week has been crazy. I haven't even gotten a lot of time to sit down and paint and really get some things together. It's been a thousand and one meetings, so much preparation for so many things to come. So if you really, really, really wanna be down, make sure you hop on the newsletter. I send out uh, discount codes, even more updates and all sorts of goodies. So head over there. That's gonna be it. That's gonna be it for this week. Thank you so much for watching. And of course, if you like this video, like it. I'll see you all next week. Wake up, get up, stretch my. Is she looking? Look, y'all see, y'all see the camera. <laughs> Look. Hey,
Brush my teeth up, watch my face Throw my clothes on, start my day Wake up, I can smell the smoke from the bacon 